I know I usually talk about a lot of relationships and all that type of stuff, but today we're going to talk about you because this message is for you. I know you've been going through a lot of stuff throughout the years. You've been trying real hard to make things happen. And the devil's been trying to break you, working through people, trying to break you, trying to be negative. I know your, your family haven't been the best to you. You know what I mean? You haven't been perfect yourself, but you got a big heart. And you just can't get broken. The devil has tried all kinds of ways and seemed like he almost got you. But he just you slipped through his hands for some reason. Because you're not made to be broken. You're not made to be a part of the devil kingdom. And you you are aware that it's a spiritual warf warfare going on out here. And the devil can work through anybody. He can work through that cashier at 7-Eleven. He can work through your family member, your kid, your wife, your girlfriend, your, your friends. But you still haven't been broken yet. Because you're not made to be like that. I know things ain't going as fast as you want it to be go fast. You're working on what your projects, you know what you can do, and you know you can do it good. It just seems like you just can't get past that next wall. And you know you can do it deep in heart. But I want you to know that God got you. No matter what. You just got to trust in God. No matter if you what you see, what you what you see or what you don't see. Keep doing what you know what's in your heart to do. Whether you see fruits of your labor or not, something good going to come out, out of it. You can't see it now. But something good is going to come out of it. You just got to keep trusting in God. After all, this is his story. This is heaven's story. We just a part of the... We just characters in the story. So keep on doing what you're doing. Don't let nobody deter you. Don't let the devil fool you or deceive you. Keep on doing what you're doing. Stay strong. First and foremost, most, most of all, stay prayed up. It's not easy when you feel like you don't have no support. When you feel like you're alone. When you feel like you're misunderstood. When you feel like people don't care about you. I know, I know, I, trust me, I know. It's not easy. When when. The people that's supposed to have been supporting you. Have turned their backs on you. It's not easy. But keep your head up. Because. Just when you get ready to give up. That's when you're about to. Reach the next level. So basically what I'm saying is. Never give up. You can try other things, but never give up on your passion and what makes you happy because that means that's your purpose. Whether you get a million dollars for it or if you get a dollar for it or whether you get nothing for it. Just keep doing it. Something good going to come out of it. Something good. Everything you do going to have an effect. God, God sees everything. He sees your effort. He sees your heart. He sees your intentions. You're not always going to be appreciated. You're not always going to be recognized or given credit for what you do. You may be discredited. You may be unappreciated. But what I must say is, keep going. Keep praying. Keep pushing through. Why? Because God is by your side, man. You know who you are. Don't base your worth on your looks, your money, your status, your credentials. All that stuff is man-made. It can, it can come and go. But who you are as a person remains forever and eternal. You're not always going to get credit. Hey, you may be the only person to see this video. Because the, alg the algorithm is not on my side. My videos don't come in suggested for some reason. The devil works. The devil always keep working. He never take a break. 
I'm, I may not get a million views on this, but at least you're going to see it. It's going to mean something to you, you know, because you need to hear this because you have nobody to talk to. You really don't have nobody to talk to. Yeah, people may smile or you may act like they want to be around you, but they don't really give a giver. They don't really give a backbone, a backside. You be, and deep inside, you know, most people want to see you fail. Because in this world, Satan has infiltrated most people's hearts. So don't take it personal. If they was in their right mind, in their right heart, they would want the best for you and want to help you. And you would help them. You would help each other. It would be no need on the planet if everybody helped each other. It would be no need. At all. So just keep pushing. Stay focused. Don't try to compete and look at other people's path. Some people look like they, they're doing happier than you. Some people seem like they're more happier than you. But, but trust me, they have insecurities. They have You have some things that they want. Even though outside looking in, they may look like they have the world. Keep pushing. Stay in your lane. Wish the best for people. Keep praying. Be deaf to negativity. Be deaf to it. Don't focus on it. Keep on doing what you're doing. You're going to have stuff working against you all the time. Because that's what God's children go through. They got to hold a cross. God's children be holding a cross. That's just how it go. So my advice to you is keep pushing, man. Laugh. Learn to laugh at that. Laugh through it all. Because you already know that's their job to try to slow you down. It's just a spiritual warfare. It's their job to try to discourage you. They're only doing their job. This evil matrix is the Satan's, Satan's lair. But you can't be touched. You are a warrior. At times you feel like giving up. At times you think, that are you wasting your time? At times you feel like, man, what is this? What am I doing? But trust me, God see what you're doing. And just when it's time to put his hand on what you're doing, it's going to take what you're doing to a whole nother level in ways that you didn't anticipate. Keep doing what you're doing. Keep your head up. Stay focused. Keep laughing. Keep dancing. Keep getting good sleep. Keep eating good foods. Keep fasting. Keep drinking a lot of water. Keep eating your vegetables. Keep drinking your teas, your chamomile, your moringa. This message is only for you. You may, you're, you may be the only person to see this. The algorithm does not work in my favor. My videos do not come up on suggested. I don't know why. Millions of people are not going to see this video. But guess who's going to see it? You. Because this message is for you. Because you're going to change lives. Sometime you reach one person, you don't reach them all. God work in mysterious ways. Sometime all you need is one. One quality person to get the message. And the world changes from just one. Don't get deceived. God can take anything and bless it. God can take anything and bless it. Keep your head up. Stay prayed up. Even when it looks like you can't see no results. 
Even when it look like you're hopeless, laugh through it all because you got the soul of a of eternal realm. You got the soul of heaven. I'm Alan Williams, the Millionaire. I'm not hard to find. If you want to inbox me, feel free. If you want to talk to me, feel free. But just remember, every rock shall be, it's no rock that don't get turned over. So God see you. So just when you think you're wasting your time and you're just running in place, you don't see no results. Trust me, everything you do will come to light. Everything. You take care. Alan Williams, the Rillionaire. Rillionaire Nation, we out. Oh, by the way, I'm going to get another page. And this page is not going to have my name on it. So, but you'll, you'll, you will see it. You will come across the page. You will see it. Also, check out Simon. That's my, that's my little character, my little my little cartoon character. He talks about a lot of funny stuff, but he talks about a lot of truth. So check out him too, Simon. You'll see it, the cartoon with the beard. Anyway, hey, be safe out there. Remember, keep pushing. The devil just doing his job trying to hold you back, trying to catch you, trying to kept, catch you slipping in your desires, your fears, your insecurities, and your impatience. But you're not going to fall for that. You're too small, you're too strong for that. You're too smart for that. 